Hey guys, this is VDHS DVD and Blu-rays Media Corner here. And I just want to say to you all, Happy New Year's Eve, everybody. And guys, this is going to be my last video of 2022. So yeah. So guys, I'm going to give you my thoughts on 2022, starting with January. January has been fine, I guess. Just nothing special in January. And I... I, I I definitely have to agree with Frozen about the January hate face. Yes, I know January is underrated, but it's just that January is, like, nothing special to me. Like, uh, back in, like, January of this year, I got, a, I got, uh, my family got COVID, and I had to get freaking online school, which I hate online school so much with a burning passion. School in person is way better than online school. Anyway, February was, eh, not that much stuff. It was still good, but nothing, nothing special about it. March was a good month, but it's, it, it's still good. Yeah, it's a good month for me. It's, I, I, it, it's good. And, but April, I'm gonna tell you, April has been an awesome month for me because I went to Wisconsin Dells. During that time, and not only that, I also saw Sonic the Hedgehog 2 at Wisconsin Dells at AMC, which I had a very fun time seeing that movie. And I also, um, also a day after that, I went to Build-A-Bear, and I got that, um, Tails plush from Build-A-Bear, which, guys, I still have that plush to this day. Yeah. May 2022 was a great month, but the only negative I have for May 2022 is, um... The Rob Elementary School shooting, which, honestly, I actually feel bad. I, I felt bad for the kids and teachers who died in there. I also feel bad, and I also felt bad for the parents who lost their children, who lost their loved ones. Yeah. Yeah. Still pretty sad to this day. But we're going to get to June of 2022. June has been a good month, honestly, and... Back in June, it, 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 I was actually, I was going to my very, it was actually my very first time going to Regal Cinema, to, and I went to see Lightyear during that time, which my opinion on Regal Cinema, it's really great, it, same with Classic Cinemas and AMC and Marquez Cinema, and um, July, oh boy, I gotta tell you, July has been great, man, I went to Los Angeles, not only that, I also went to see Minions, The Rides of Gru, which I, I did have a fun time seeing that movie in theaters. And I also went to the beach, I also went to the Universal Studios rides in there, oh boy, I had a lot of fun in there. August was a pretty good month for me, honestly, I thought August was good in my opinion. September was good, I, I, I enjoyed my birthday, I had a really good birthday back in September. Yeah, October was, oh boy, October, oh boy, I really like October, it's a really great month, I had a great Halloween, I, I went to see Black Adam, I really enjoyed Black Adam, yeah, November, guys, to be honest, November 2022 has got to be one of the best months of this year, because honestly, I saw Black Panther Wakanda Forever at Marquez Cinema. I really loved it. It was very emotional and it was a great and it was a really awesome film. And I also I did also had a great Thanksgiving. I did went to my tia's house to eat some Thanksgiving dinner and I, a day after that I went Black Friday shopping. I got I got some DVDs and some Blu-rays. And I also, after I went to Walmart on that day, I went to go see Strange World on my, at my local AMC theater. Which, my opinion on Strange World is, it's a really good movie in my opinion. I actually enjoyed it. And December of this month? December has been good, honestly. I, I did enjoy Avatar The Way of... I, 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 but the best thing that happened, the best thing that happened in December of this year... Has to be when I saw Avatar The Way of Water. That is the best thing that happened this month in December. And, um, yeah. Avatar The Way of Water is still my favorite movie of 2022. In fact, not only that, it's actually my now my second favorite movie of all time. 
but Encanto goes to number three now. So yeah, and I and I on Chris I had a great Christmas. I had a great Christmas. I I got some good stuff for Christmas, and I also saw Puss in Boots: The Last Wish on Christmas Day, which I enjoyed that film. But I still prefer Avatar: The Way of Water, in my opinion. So overall, I, 2022 has been a good year so far. It's been not that bad. I think 2022 is a good year, but. But uh, unlike the other two, which I don't want to talk about it. And now let's get to movies for 2022. Movies, movies has been great. There are a lot of masterpiece movies. There are a lot of movies that are masterpieces like Sonic the Hedgehog 2, um, Top Gun Maverick. What else? Oh yeah, um, Jurassic World Dominion, Thor: Love and Thunder, um. <coughs> Black Adam and Black Panther: Wakanda Forever and um, Avatar: The Way of Water. Yeah, a lot of these movies has been really good this, so far. Some have been high. Some of them have been decent. Which the only ones I can think about are only Puss in Boots: The Last Wish and Minions: The Rise of Gru. Note: If you hate Minions: The Rise of Gru, I can accept your opinion. But for me, I thought it was pretty decent. But, oh god, let's talk about animation in 2022. Animation has gone bad done in 2022. Like, we got some we got some bad movies like, um, what's that movie? Oh yeah, we got that crappy movie, Hotel Transylvania 4, which I literally forgot that movie existed. Ice Age Bucket of Wild, um, what else? Oh yeah, Pause of Fury, DC League of Super Pets, um... Those, um, and other stuff, yeah. But I still think 2022 has been a good year so far. Yeah. So overall, my rating for 2022 is seven out of ten. I actually liked it. So yeah. All right, guys. So this is gonna. This is now my final video of 2022. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And peace out, y'all. And I'll see y'all in 2023. Peace.